Good evening. This is Anita from Murisari. The latest updates are Chief Minister Navin Patnaik today dedicated a 150 bed tested COVID hospital in the premises of Sri Jagannath Medical College at Puri on virtual platform. Built with the collaboration of some hospital Bhuneshwar, the facility has 90 general oxygen beds, 40 HDU beds and 20 ICU beds. It is also equipped with high quality laboratory and diagnostic facility. Chief Minister said that the hospital will be helpful in providing better medical care to critical COVID patients of the district and they will not have to look for hospitals in Bhuneshwar or Katak. The entire expenditure of for operation of the COVID hospital will be borne from Chief Minister's relief fund. The Chief Minister announced, he added that all beds have been connected with oxygen pipeline and oxygen beds would be further increased if required. He thanked the Institute of Medical Sciences and some hospital Bhuneshwar for coming forward to team up with the state government for this COVID care facility. Saying that this is a very challenging time for all of us in the country, the CM said that this pandemic has created a huge humanitarian crisis. It's a threat to our lives, our health and our general well-being, he added. He further said that last year in the first wave, despite the economic impact, we contained the virus with the greatest success. This year, in the second wave, we have so far been able to contain it largely. The recovery rate is also improving, he added. Chief Minister said that we have a robust COVID infrastructure and are working to improve it further. The government is making every possible effort to provide best treatment facilities and save precious lives, he informed. Appealing the people to follow all COVID norms to beat the pandemic, Shri Patnaik said that success in containing this pandemic lies in checking the virus and breaking its chain. The Chief Minister appreciated the people of Odisha for cooperation in the fight against the pandemic. The Ministry of Home Affairs issued an advisory to all state governments and union territories to focus on vulnerable sections of society. The government stated that it has been giving high priority on preventing and combating crimes against vulnerable sections of society including women, children, senior citizens and scheduled caste and scheduled tribes. Odisha cabinet attended tender documents and terms and conditions for global e tender floated or procurement of vaccines to attract more bidders. Approval for bidding has also been given to vaccines with a capacity of minus 20 degrees stories. One person died and another sustained injuries in lightning strike during post-death rituals at Jagamohan village in Ganzam district. That's all for today's news. Stay tuned for the next. Thank you.